The group has come to China to give free exams for the victims six times thus far. This time, the group came to the aid of 27 victims of mustard gas bombs that were left behind in northeast China's Heilongjiang province, where the infamous Unit 731 conducted ghastly experiments on Chinese victims during World War II. In addition to doctors and nurses, the group has also brought physical therapists so as to provide comprehensive assessments and monitoring for the patients. My eyes suffered from muscle weakness after I was poisoned by the mustard gas. I also have a cerebral infection and a skin ulcer. The health exam was free. They gave me a magnetic resonance imaging and checked my liver, blood and skin. They also gave me a memory test. Previously, the checks mainly focused on skin and respiratory diseases. But after some years of experience, the organization is now monitoring the patient's nervous systems, as well as looking for possible carcinogens. We must change our medical treatment based on the real condition of the patients. We try to do our best to help them. The group comes to Heilongjiang to provide the checks every two years. Civil volunteers and lawyers have also joined the group over time. The patient's situation is updated and documented with each visit. Unit 731 was a top-secret biological and chemical warfare research unit established in Heilongjiang's capital of Harbin in 1935. The unit served as the backbone of Japanese biological warfare efforts conducted in China and Southeast Asia during the war. At least 3,000 people were killed in the unit's experiments including civilians and prisoners of war from China, the former Soviet Union, the Korean Peninsula, and Mongolia.